Hey everyone, a very warm welcome to Novation. I'm Shantanu and I'm very very excited to present this year's books and authors session. And friends, we are going to discuss various important MCQs uh, related to the important books which were launched this year. And we will see many subtle uh, points which are in the questions. And if you are targeting any exam, like it be uh, IFT or ZAT, TIS or CMAT or even banks so any state level exam this is going to be a very very essential topic so please uh, you know take out your pens and notebooks and start writing the things which you don't know because this is going to be a very exciting session this is one of my favorite topics because I love books and I like to make uh, videos related to books so yes uh, this is going to be a good session please uh, keep the things in mind and I'm sure this is going to be very helpful for you all right so let's uh, jump into the session right now the first question for today Late former President of India, Shri Pranab Mukherjee, released uh, an autobiography titled Relentless. Who is the author of this book? So friends, generally kya hota hai? Writers jo hota hai, wo uh, book lik dete hai and they try to publicize it. So wo kisi na kisi eminent personality se us book ko launch ya release karwate hai. So here, who uh, is the author? The correct answer is B, Yashwan Sinha. And he asked uh, the former President Pranab Mukherjee to uh, release this book. Okay, so let's see what this book is all about. So this book basically describes uh, Yashwan Sinha's journey from his normal life to a, a how he grew in his political life. And he also served as the finance minister uh, during the tenure of Atal Bihari Vajpayee, who's, who is the late former uh, prime minister of our country. So uh, Yash this book is all about Yashwan Sinha. All right, moving forward. Identify the theme of the 20th edition of New Delhi World Book Fair 2020 which is uh, NDWBF 2020. All right. So the correct answer is A, Gandhi, the writer's writer. So friends, this uh, book fair was the theme of this book. Friends, the theme of the book was asked many times, but it was asked many times, so it was asked Let's see the PTN. So the theme of NDWBF uh, 2020 book, of, book fair was Gandhi, the writer's writer. And this was because uh, the book fair was kind of uh, celebrating 150 years of Mahatma Gandhi's birth. So this uh, was the uh, main motive while keeping the theme as Gandhi, the writer's writer. All right, moving ahead. Name the author of the book, Lady, You Are the Boss. So this is the name of the book. And who's the author? The correct answer is C, Apurva Purohit. So Apurva Purohit is the president of Jagran Group. So friends, you might be knowing that Jagran is a very famous media house in our country. Uh, which uh, publishes the paper, newspaper called Danik Jagran. And this story is about Apurva Purohit's personal experiences. And she also reveals how women uh, minimize themselves and this uh, suffer from imposter syndrome. That means that uh, females generally con consider themselves below others. So uh, that's how she motivates uh, the, uh, the ladies that you, you are boss. Don't consider yourself below anyone else. All right. So women should, should not settle for less. That's the whole point of this book. Moving ahead, Union Minister Nitin Gadkari. So Nitin Gadkari is the Minister for uh, Roads uh, and uh, also for MSME. All right. Uh, presented a copy of book Invincible, a tribute to Manohar Parikar to President Ramnath Kovind. This book is authored by. So friends, uh, this book is about Manohar Parikar, who is our former, uh, late former Defence Minister, and this book is written by Tarun Vijay. Another important thing is Tarun Vichai asked uh, the Defence Minister, who is the present Defence Minister, Rajnath Singh Ji, to release this book. All right, and this is about the life of late former Defence Minister Manohar Parikar. Uh, moving forward, name the author of the book Messiha Modi, a tale of great expectations. So, as expected, this book is about our Prime Minister Narendra Modi, and this book is written by B. Tavleen Singh. Jante is book me kya hai? So, friends. Uh, what Tavleen writes is that she was really uh, not expecting that Narendra Modi will will come back to power in 2019, and uh, she she says that she uh, it was her inability that she could not expect that. All right, and uh, she also says that along with her, many other people like most of the left leaning uh, people in India were uh, highly surprised that uh, Narendra Modi got again got a uh, huge uh, victory and he became the prime minister of our country. All right, so this book is all about that. Moving ahead, name the author of the book, How Contagion Works, Science, Awareness and Community in Times of Global Crisis. So friends, this book basically tells us the contagion here refers to COVID outbreak. All right, and uh, the writer is A, Paolo uh, Giordano and he's from Italy. All right, Italian writer. 
So the book explores the crisis through the lens of science and society, and it gives various facts related to, to how pandemic is dealt uh, with the lens of science and society. And uh, this book was shared millions of times online, and uh, you know it kind of changed how debates were going on around coronavirus. All right, so important one because uh, you know corona is a very hot topic. Moving forward, sports journalist. Uh, journalist uh, V. Krishna Swami authored a book about the ace shuttler P. V. Sindhu. What's the name of the book? Friends, the correct answer is A. Shuttling to the top, the story of P. V. Sindhu. This is the correct answer, and other others are wrong. So let's see the PTN. So as you must have understood that this book narrates the journey of badminton player P. V. Sindhu from her early life to becoming a world champion, and what all uh, lies ahead with her life. Moving ahead. Name the author of the book. How the onion got its layer. So, friends, this book is basically a book written for children, and the writer is C. Sudha Murthy, one of the most famous uh, story writers in India. And it's a children's book, as I told you. We seek answer to several questions related to the bulb of the onion, like how, why there are many layers, and why it brings tears uh, to the eyes when cut. Okay, so uh, you know, kind of providing some kind of information related to science and awareness uh, to the children uh, because children were getting bored during lockdown. So it uh, was launched during lockdown by Sudha Murthy. And moving forward. Name the ministry which launched hashtag My Book My Friend cam- Friend campaign on World Book Day. Friends, the correct answer is B. Ministry of Education. And when this uh, campaign was launched, uh, Ministry of Education was known as MHRD. That is Ministry of Human Resource Development. Now it is called Ministry of Education. So PTN, the student must read some book of interest in addition to course books, so they will be given the opportunity to learn something new. So this campaign was to um to you know make children read more or tell their pa- parents that yes uh, children should be encouraged to read more and more and should make books as their best friend all right i hope this is clear aage badhte hain name the author of the book wuhan diary dispatches from a quarantined city again friends this is related to a uh, coronavirus again book related to, to it so the correct answer is here is c Fang Fang. So Fang Fang wrote this diary, which was, you know, published as a book. So this book is a compilation of online diary entries and social media posts that document 60 days of lockdown during COVID-19 in Wuhan. So uh, this was basically from where this virus started to originate. The this was the epicenter, and that's why people call this virus as China virus. Okay, Wuhan virus maybe. And okay, moving forward. On the 86th birthday, famous writer Ruskin Bond released his new book named. So, हमें नाम बताना है. And Ruskin Bond again, friends, children's story writer हैं. बहुत famous writer हैं. इनकी books मैं आपको भी recommend करूँगा. भले आप बड़े हैं, children नहीं हैं. You can still read those books. They are very very interesting. Okay. So here the correct answer is B. Hop on my adventures on boats, trains, and planes. This is the correct one. And uh, Ruskin Bond also published some more books in 2020. उनका नाम है अ सॉन्ग ऑफ इंडिया दिस इज वेरी वेरी असेंशियल आपको पता होना चाहिए एंड मेराकल एट हैप्पी बाजार सो प्लीज इन तीनों बुक्स को आप नोट कर लीजिए क्योंकि रस्किन बॉन्ड की बुक्स काफी इंपॉर्टेंट होती हैं बिकॉज ही इज एन इंडियन राइटर एंड ही इज वेरी फेमस वर्ल्ड वाइड मूविंग अहेड लेजेंड ऑफ सुहेल देव द किंग हु सेव्ड इंडिया इज द न्यू बुक बाय फ्रेंड्स ये तो एकदम नो ब्रेनर है आपको पता होना चाहिए कौन है इसका राइटर करेक्ट आंसर इज ए अमिश त्रिपाठी वन ऑफ द यू नो वेरी फेमस फिक्शन राइटर फ्रॉम इंडिया Moving ahead, name the author of the book the Ika Bog. So friends, uh, I'm not sure how it is pronounced. I just pronounce it Ika Bog. So someone of some of you may be correcting me. Uh, the correct answer here is C. J. K. Rowling. So another very famous writer. She got famous from her uh, book on books on Harry Potter. So it's her first book aimed at children since Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows. Hallows, sorry. So yeah. So J. K. Rowling's books are very important. Please, this go note down. कर लीजिए. Very important. है. आगे बढ़ते हैं द फॉर्मर गवर्नर ऑफ आर बी आई उर्जित पटेल ऑथर्ड विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग बुक्स रिसेंटली फ्रेंड्स द करेक्ट आंसर इज सी ओवर ड्राफ्ट सेविंग द इंडियन सेवर 
लेट्स सी द पीटीएन सो वॉट दिस बुक इज ऑल अबाउट इज द नॉन परफॉर्मिंग एसेट्स सो हमने एनपीए के बारे में कई बार बात की है सो so मैं फिर से रिपीट नहीं करूंगा यहाँ पे एंड वाई दिस इशू इज कॉजिंग यूज डिस्ट्रेस टू आर इकोनॉमी एंड द बैंकिंग सेक्टर अगेन दिस बुक ऑल्सो हाईलाइट्स द कॉजेज ऑफ एनपीए वाई देर सच अ लार्ज अमाउंट ऑफ एनपीए अकर्स इन इंडिया एंड हाउ उर्जित पटेल हैड डेल्ट विद इट वेन ही वॉज द गवर्नर ऑफ आर बी आई मूविंग हेड Which of these famous horror writers released their new book If It Bleeds in 2009, in 2020, or recently? So friends, if you like horror reading, then of course you will have heard Stephen King's name. One of the best horror writers, and he has released a new book now. It, its, its name is If It Bleeds. All right, moving uh, to the PTN. So the book has the story centers around a bomb at Albert McCready Middle School. and it is a sequel to his best selling work the outsider so earlier book was outsider and this is a sequel to this book and uh, i will i will recommend that agar aap bhale aapko horror pasand nahi hai par ek bar zarur stephen king ki book ko isi padhiyega aage badhte hain who among the following famous australian cricketers published the book titled the spirit of cricket india friends the correct answer is b steve waugh and he was the former captain of australian cricket team और फ्रेंड्स ये बुक जो है बेसिकली एक फोटो बुक है इसमें कई सारी फोटोज मिलेंगी जो कि स्टीव वॉ ने खुद क्लिक की हैं व्हेन ही केम टू इंडिया फॉर अ यू नो फॉर अ जर्नी और फॉर विजिटिंग इंडिया जस्ट एज अ टूरिस्ट सो ही क्लिक वेरियस इमेजेस एंड आउट ऑफ देम 220 ट्वेंटी इमेजेस ही पुट इन इन हिस्स बुक एंड डिस्क्राइब हाउ क्रिकेट हैज बीन यू नो काइंड ऑफ अ स्पिरिट इन इंडिया All right. So spirit and uh, you know we are so much into cricket. We are a country which love cricket. So he has described the emotions and everything through various images. All right. Moving ahead. Quest for restoring financial stability in India. So this is the uh, book, and uh, this book is written by a, uh, one of the former deputy governors of Reserve Bank of India. So in me se kaun hai wo? Correct answer hai, dosto Viral Acharya. Ab ab ye uh, nahi hai. Uh, as the, he is not holding the position of deputy governor he is a former deputy governor but uh, michael patra bp ganun go and mk jain uh, these four uh, people are still as the deputy governor of rbi and this book is a summary of what he learned by trying to direct economic policy drawing on his prolific work in finance and economics so whatever he has learned or did uh, throughout his tenure he has put into this book moving ahead which of the following books uh, I'm sorry, this should not be here. Books written by Avni Doshi were uh, long-listed for 2020 Booker Prize. So, long-listed here means basically considered uh, as a nomination for Booker Prize. All right. So, the correct answer here is D. Both A and C. So, friends, the girl in cotton, uh, white cotton, and burnt sugar. These are basically same books. India में जो book release हुई है उसका नाम है Girl in White Cotton. और जो uh, outside India जो book release हुई थी उसका नाम है Burnt Sugar. so uh, her debut novel burn sugar published in india fourth estate uh, by fourth estate as girl in white cotton and it was long listed for 2020 booker prize so even getting a nomination is really a big thing friends all right moving ahead chetan bhagat's recent or uh, the latest book released in september 2020 is title so hum book ka title batana hai dosto chetan bhagat bahut famous writer hai in india ke so unki book aana bahut possible hai correct answer is a one arranged murder Let's have a look at the PTN. So uh, it is the author's ninth novel and eleventh book overall. Overall, his uh, last release was the Girl in Room One Zero Five. So this was the early one, uh, the previous one, and this is the most uh, recent one. Moving ahead, who has backed twenty twenty International Booker Prize for the book The Discomfort of Evening? Friends, this question we have done before, but I have again put it because it is very important. एंड मुझे लगता है ये एक ना एक एग्जाम में आपको जरूर आएगा सो करेक्ट आंसर इज सी मेरिक लुकस रिंजेवेल्ड राइट एंड शी इज अ डच राइटर 29 ईयर ओल्ड डच राइटर एंड बेसिकली हर बुक हैज बीन ट्रांसलेटेड फ्रॉम डच टू इंग्लिश बाय माइकल हचिसन सो दे हैव बीन गिवन दिस अवार्ड combinedly and uh, another important thing is she uh, the uh, the author has become the youngest author to be, uh, win this prestigious award all right so do remember all these points they are very important i'll move ahead 
The Presidential Years is the book authored by which of the following former presidents of India? Friends, the correct answer is C. Pranam Mukherjee. This question is very important hai because uh, this year, as you all know, that uh, India lost Pranam Mukherjee, who was one of the you know greatest statement, statesmen we ever had. So this book is really important because this was his last book, the fourth book, and uh, it ha- it will it was uh, it it was it will be released after uh, the passing away of our former president, Sri Pranam Mukherjee. All right, so uh, you should be very careful and note this down. Moving ahead, who is the author of the book *The Commonwealth of Cricket*, a, lo- a lifelong love affair with the most subtle and sophisticated game known to humankind? Friends, the correct answer is B. Ramchandra Guha. So Ramchandra Guha is a very famous historian of India, and this book is expected to be released in November 2020. And what it does is, is it traces the arc of game in India. That is, tr- tracking how game basically evolved in India across all levels. it is played for example school colleges state or country level and it also present vivid portraits of local heroes provincial icons and international stars uh, which are known to us in india all right uh, i'll move ahead who is the author of the book death and inside story so it's another very important book the correct answer is a sadguru so he has written uh, this book and he is a spiritual re- leader very famous spiritual leader Uh, in this uh, unique treatise like exposition sadguru dwells extensively upon his inner experiences as he expounds on the more profound aspects of death that are rarely spoken about so basically he tells his views about death i haven't read this book but i want to read it so yeah i'll uh, i'll be able to tell more than uh, about it then so yeah it's all about death and what sadguru basically thinks about it right i'll move forward barack obama memoir uh, dash is set to hit the bookstores in november 2020 so another book to be released in november 2020 the correct answer is a promised land so let's see the ptn so this book promised land will be the first of two volumes so there will be two volumes to this book and uh, it will have barack obama's early political life his pres- presidential campaign in 2008 and uh, this book will end this volume 1 will end with the death of osama bin laden in 2011 so Os- osama was uh, killed in pakistan of course uh, in uh, abbottabad so yeah uh, this book will end will with, uh, with that story all right uh, moving ahead checkmate how the bjp won and lost maharashtra is the book authored by which of the uh, who among the following the correct answer is d sudhir uh, suryavanshi so friends aapko pata hoga ke uh, bjp ne shuru mein uh, coalition banaya tha jab uh, elections hue the shiv sena ke sath but then both of them separated and uh, uh, they could not f- uh, form a government so uh, how bjp uh, once made a government but then again that government broke down so this book will tell the stories and how none of the parties could secure a full majority in the elections all right so moving ahead now friends uh, there are certain assignment questions which i want you to uh, tackle and uh, tell me the answers in the comment section so tell me who is the author of the india way strategies for an uncertain world next tell me the author of think like a monk and tell me the authors of memoirs and misinformations and another very important question aap mujhe us book ka naam bataiye jo bloomsbury ne publish karne se mana kar diya tha uh, it was based on delhi riots uh, and uh, bloomsbury did not publish it after uh, it faced social uh, media backlash all right so please tell me the name of this book so friends uh, we have come to an end to this session and i hope aapko books and uh, authors ab thoda yaad honge because we have discussed a lot about all the new books and important ones so if you have liked this video i request you to please give it a thumbs up share it with your friends and subscribe to novation for more awesome content aur bhi aage jo books aayengi unke liye main aapko update karte rahunga jo bhi important books hongi taki hum uh, exam tak aane tak ka wait na kare aur jo bhi books hongi hame pata ho all right friends so i'll meet you next time until then bye bye